It's a new dawn, come let's work together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let us take it, come let's take it further. Oh. Legacy is 50, you know, we got your little together. Celebrate Fahadji together. Oh, hey. Awala leko, ite si waju eko gongoni koko. Eko wa yoni di ba jela ilai. Eko wa maho. Ite si waju eko loje wa lokum. Lala ele du mari. Ashe. Oke loke la malo. Ashe. Oli tori wada rula ilai. Ite si waju eko. Our garden this morning is to celebrate success. Celebrate success of a couple who have a single focus. We have put everything aside to say that we must own our own company. It gave me an immense pleasure to welcome you all to this great occasion. I'm delighted that you are part of this historic event. I have no doubt that the monster seed you sow today we become a mighty forest in the days to come. Amen. The Pressure Pastry and Consumer Limited is an indigenous SME communal company positioned to offer high quality and delicious cookies, cake, and pastry to Nigerians at affordable price. Because I'm a believer in the Nigerian project, and nobody can change my mind about that, we have over 300 mineral resources, 40 of them are of commercial quantity. We, as a people, have no business with poverty. <coughs> if we can look inwards and organize ourselves and explore all that God has blessed us with, we, we can become you know, the, the greatest nation on earth. Now I can pull. Mrs. Arema is someone that I can uh, describe as uh, a woman of strength. Uh, she pursues whatever she believes in and what uh, the outcome of that is what we are witnessing today. I'm Bumi Arema. I got to know about the loan through the Nazi Association. Wow, it's really a help because um, initially when we branded the product, we could not afford to change the wrap for the smaller pack, the 40 gram. So we had just the 70 gram. And because some parents feel it's feel quite feeling, and for a child to finish the 70 grams at times, because it's feeling, you know, so the parents were demanding for the smaller pack. With the loan, we were able to meet that demand, that market demand. My name is Abosse De Alimi, and I look after strategy funding and stakeholder management for the Lagos State Employment Trust Fund. We're here today to launch a product by one of our beneficiaries, the Palinia Cookies. For Palinia to have gotten here, they would have gone through a process where they filled an application form. They have put together their supporting documents, including two guarantors. They could prove to us that they were a registered business in Lagos State. They were a registered taxpayer in Lagos State. And of course, they were resident here in Lagos. The Lagos State Employment Trust Fund um, has different categories of loans. Um, we have a loan category of 250,000 Naira, and that can be accessed by businesses that are startups, so we call that the micro-enterprise startup category. And basically, all you need is a training certificate. So for example, if you've gone to a bakery and you've been certified as a baker, and you want to buy a few equipment to start up your business, we can give you up to 250,000 Naira. And then the second category is a micro enterprise, which can get up to 500,000 Naira. Again, the requirements are similar to a micro enterprise startup. But Palinia falls in the category of a small, medium scale enterprise, so an SME, and they can get up to 5 million Naira. So for the ME and ME startup category, the tenure is one year, so 12 months. Um, but the category of SME, you can, the tenure is 36 months. And this is a, all at a 5% interest rate, which is the cheapest you can find in Nigeria. Uh, well, Looking at uh, the initiative itself, we know presently that the bane of our society today is unemployment. And uh, we cannot overemphasize the importance of such a trust fund 
that will assist us in curbing the menace of this unemployment which we see on our streets today. So it's a very thoughtful one and a very good panache that is coming up at the right time, at the right moment in Lagos State. The goal of the fund, as you are, as you are probably aware, is to, uh, is to increase production to generate employment and then create wealth in the state. Um, so many of our members have benefited from it. Many are still expectant and it has begun to help their businesses. As a matter of fact, um, by the time the next statistics of employment or unemployment as the case may be is released, we will observe that um, unemployment is reducing in Lagos and the GDP of the state is going, is going higher. I think it's a wonderful initiative. It's a great thing. And I just appreciate the Lagos State Government, Ambode, for that. It's a great thing because when you, you motivate entrepreneurial uh, the, the, the dimensions in the life of people, there is job creation and creativity also in the life of people, people who have passion, who are not necessarily looking for paid employment, who wants to really express themselves. It's a great opportunity for them. And I pray that the state government will go from strength to strength. Yes, you are doing